Hello, welcome to another Ryder Cam TV. Welcome to my really untidy garage. But this week we're going to talk about, through the colds that both Mark and I have got, um, Pete from pannierprotectors.co.uk or Rubber Precision Tech has sent us these brilliant pannier protectors. He's done that before, and he? he has. Thank you, Pete. Um, so we're going to have a look at them. They come in this massive, massive bag with do not bend everywhere and all the problems that we're having with raw mail, it actually arrived in one piece. Wow. You know, so if there's ever a success for 2022, that is it, getting something through the raw mail. <laughs> right, what are these? Right, then? these are rubber pannier protectors and you can see how thick they are. They must be, what, five, six mil thick? Must be, mustn't they? Oh, I know. I'd say three, but... About three? Yeah. But they're really, really hard wearing, got knobbly bits on the top, and they have got um, self-adhesive sticky, sticky stuff on the bottom. Stickiness? And literally, they just go in between there on both panniers. And it's something that I've wanted for a long time on these boom up panniers, because although the panniers are amazing, because they're, I don't think they're actually, I think they're powder coated, I'm not sure, but when you polish it or you kick it, I'm quite wary of scratching it. So with these, it's going to be really good, isn't it? Yeah, I like Pete a lot because he's actually, we've worked with Pete a few times now. And on my last panniers, me and my grandson actually measured my panniers up and sent off because he didn't have them for our types of boxes. Yeah. So we, and he made them to fit us. Ah. So um, he's a really nice guy. So they're really simple to fit. Really simple. You I'm get, glad about that. Yeah, you get instructions, but basically you get three, it's really good, you get three pouches of this My Wipe, which is alcohol cleaning wipe, or IPA cleaning wipe, contains 100% isopropyl alcohol. Wow. I was going to say, you can suck it as well then if you want. <laughs> <laughs> but, as you can imagine, the panniers need to be cleaned, don't they? So you can see... And I remember you doing this to yours, yours as well, didn't you? Yep. In fact, I think I've had mine, I've had two lots on my bike. Yeah, you've had them for ages, haven't you? Yep, really like them. What I like about them is you can put your helmet on them when you just stop, you know, briefly. You, yeah. Like, if you put your helmet on there now, it's going to slide off, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. You put it well, on with those thing, rubber things it? and the helmet stick, stays yeah. out. Obviously, don't leave it forever, but, you know, just a moment while you open your top box and things like that. A moment on the hips. <laughs> And you can see, I mean, it's, it's December and it's quite cold, isn't it? But it is drying off, isn't it? So I may as well do this one at the same time, because while we stick that one on, this can be drying, can't it? It can, yeah. Can I just make a comment while we're in there? You've got half your, half your father Christmas suit on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. So let's just do this one. Well the other one is drying off and if we were doing this in the summer this alcohol would evaporate really quickly before wouldn't you'd it? even done it i think sorry before you'd even yeah got it out of the packet it shows you how different our weather is at the moment doesn't it very strange right. so Might before just peel I... that back a little bit again let me see what was underneath that sticky stuff no it was... oh oh colorful sticky stuff yeah that does it smell it smells of rubber odd yeah Right, just going to see where it needs to fit. So it is a really good fit. I mean, look at that. So I need to make sure that it's it's kind of even as much as possible, don't I? So if I put it right up against there, it's going to be too far from the back. <laughs> oh, what a nightmare for you. <laughs> you, are, you are so caring, Mark. <laughs> what a nightmare for you. Right. This is our 15th attempt at doing this, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Right, now what we did last time is I bent it over like that so you don't stick it all at the same time. So I know that it's got to be kind of central and it's got to be off there a little bit. So I'm kind of happy with that. So I'm going to then just peel this back whilst, as you saw, with my handy... That's what the cloth's for. <clears throat> cloth. Well, I don't want to hurt my fingers. And then I can pull the backing away. Get him a job on Blue Peter. So is Blue Peter still about? Yeah, of course it is. Is it? Yeah. 
Hello. Oh, it's all gone wrong. Oh. <laughs> take 16. Yeah, this is take 16. So I'm slightly off on the side. So now I'm happy with that, I think. So this is the only, only difficult side, isn't it? That's better. Right, so now I can do it. <clears throat> so we make mistakes here on the channel just so that you don't have to. That's our excuse, isn't it, Mark? No, don't we just think? make mistakes. <laughs> <clears throat> now what I like about these is, as you can see, that the, ban the boom up panniers curve quite a bit. And these don't go too far over that curve. So I'm hoping that they, it doesn't start lifting on the corners. So that's why I'm just putting quite a lot of pressure. Hence the fact that I've got a cloth just to put that pressure on there. So it actually sticks properly. Whereas there on the boom up panniers, it's, it's quite an angle. So it's quite strange, isn't it? Well, on mine, I've had no issues with them peeling. In fact, it'd be a nightmare to try and peel off of them. Yeah. Because they're on that. But look at the that protection world. that that's going to give. That's amazing, isn't it? I really like them. Cheers, Pete. But they not only are effective, but they look good as well, don't they? Yeah. I've seen a few people with these now abroad. Have you? Yeah. Whether they're Pete's or not, I don't know, but <clears throat> well, they look similar. Well, the thing is, you can buy them from different places, can't you? You can buy different things, but the, yeah. the ones that we've found to be really good quality are these, these ones here. There you go. Rubber if I just, protection. If I just hold that over here, yeah. out of the light. Light like that. by the light. There it all is. Well, I put this other one on. Oh, let's watch this then, because it's always interesting. <laughs> Right, let's, oh, see it move. See, we're experts, look. Right. Expert, X being an old has-been, a spurt a drip under pressure. Unbelievable. Oh, was that right? Are you happy with that? No, <laughs> it needs to come to the left a little bit. So this is a good thing about using the um, alcohol, isn't it? Because if you use the alcohol to put, to, drink to clean it, it off, <laughs> yeah, well, it is Christmas, isn't it? But look at that. Look at that. Your boom up panniers made for the brave look even braver now. They do, don't they? Wrecking this cloth, but better than wrecking my hand. I mean, look at that. Yeah, I've got to be honest, I didn't faff around as much as this, Tobes. Did you not? No. That was a surprise. <laughs> no, I just yeah. stuck mine on. There might be a bit skew with, but you know. How cool is that? I'm really happy with them, mate. I'm well, happy for you. And the good thing about it is there ain't much rubbish. I know that they come in a plastic bag and all that sort of stuff, but you know, that's a reusable, bu reusable bag and I'll reuse that as well. Excellent. So that's good. You're such a caring person. Cardboard will go for recycling. So will the plastic. Brilliant. So. As I just clean up here, oh. Pete, thank you very much for our protection, our pannier protectors. Really, really good um, pieces of kit. Thank you for sending them. It's a nice Christmas present, isn't it? Check yours out from Rubber Precision Tech or at the top, pannierprotectors.co.uk. Hopefully you'll be able to see that. I think so now. They're about, I think you can get them for about 40 quid for the two. If you want the three set, I think they're about 60 quid. But to be fair, the box is like a thousand pounds, 1500 quid for the set, aren't they? Protecting them for that little bit of money, but such good quality product. It's really good, isn't it? So give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button somewhere, and we'll see you in the next video.